DJ Sharp MC. Live, 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 live. Back on the track. So I loaded some sounds. Let's make a beat. Um, I think I had some sounds. Your actions. So I loaded some sounds. And before I get started, um, I was going to mess around with the, with the uh, time stretch. So I got some other sounds, I think on number one, that's uh, 175. So I was going to try something. So let's, uh, let's try it. So that sound right there is 175. So I'm going to set this to 175, and we're going to just do a quick check. Then this video might get jacked because I, I almost used up all my memory. Low memory, save your projects. So I kind of overdid it with the sample load. But anyway, that sounds like it's not even one bar, but let's try to record it. Okay, and so now I wanted to do time stretch, and it, let's just see if we can do it real quick. Actually, I should save because uh, this thing might crash because I, I load it too much. All right, so then let's go to program edit, or actually let's go to sample. There's the sample. Let's go to process, double-click on discard, go to time stretch, and we see eight there 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 and i was going to try something so first we're going to try bringing it down just to see what happens so i'm going to bring it down to a 120 which is or let's do a 128 so do it to a 128 and then we'll listen to it of course the timing is going to be off actually let's even fix the timing just so we could just do the whole thing so then we'll take this to 128 and we'll see if it fixes the loop. And at least we'll have that part of the video done. I don't know if I'm gonna keep it there though. So this is time stretching it to a smaller BPM and then changing the sequence after we've already checked it at the full speed. So this, let's see if it loops clean. So the loop is clean, it's just not long enough. So that's, a, that's an interesting dilemma that because we shrunk it, it's now not big enough. So does that mean it's one bar? Let's find out. Pretty close. All right. So then the next thing I was going to do, just to kind of hear how it sounds, and I think I saw DJ Abe do this one time where he took it all the way down. So I'm going to take it all the way down. Let's just, let's just do it. So sample, process, and he went all the way down to like, I think it went to 40, but I'll go to, let's go to 80 first. Do it. Then let's do it one more time and do it down to 40. I think 40 is as low as you can go. Oh, and you can go all the way to, you can go all the way to one. Let's do one. That's, this is going to be stupid, but let's do it anyway. Time stretch to one BPM. Up. Oh. Maybe that's going to kill the processor. Yeah, it was a nice try. Cancel. All right, so let's do process. Let's do, we'll be reasonable. We'll do 40. Do it. Interesting sound effect. All right, so now let's, now let's see if we can take it back up. Let's just see if it saves it. The original, I think, was one, one seventy-five. So let's just go back up, and then we'll see if it if it kept all the information correctly, so that the loop is clean. One, I think I got to make the bars back to two. Sounds as clean as it was to the original to me. 
put it back on 175 and let's see if it works. All right. So that was a good test. Now, um, I don't know if I'm gonna do 175 or this beat here, because this beat, when I finally loaded, you know, like 10 or 20 different programs, this sounded good to me. Or this one. I actually like those. And then this one. And then I put one here. So I was going to do a fast drum and bass one, or I can do a house one. Um, let's try to do a drum and bass just to see, just to see if we could do it. So let's find a, let's find, we got that first beat that I think, uh, I don't know if we'll keep it. Let's see if we're going to keep it. I think that's pretty generic. That's all right. That's a little fast. That sounds all right. Nope. Maybe. Nope. Nope. That sounds pretty cool. I like this one. Uh, Alright, let's see what else we got. I should count these just so we can see how many you could load. Good drum beat yet. Hmm. I don't like any of those drum beats. Um. I wonder if I can speed this one up. If it'll sound good. Uh. Let's find out. Sample edit. Process. Time stretch. So sometimes it'll do this, it'll put 60, but it's actually 128. So if you try to do it when it auto checks it and it comes out low, but the beat is fast, that means you gotta double it. So this is gonna be 120.4 or something like that maybe. All right, let's just put it on 120 because I know it's supposed to be 120, or at least I think it's supposed to be 120. Let's uh, put it on 120, 120, zero, zero, do it. Okay, so that's 120, and then my beat, that is my drum and bass, BPM is 175. So let's just listen to this sample at 175, do it. So that's not gonna work. All right, so we don't have a drum beat, but I think I'm gonna wing it. I actually like uh, this sound right here. So let's save and we'll record over what we had. And I don't know if there's a way to check memory by percentages. Uh, can you see memory by percentages? Shift preferences. Info. Ether. Sequence. MIDI. Hardware. Projects. Load. Report. General. Splice. Um, the other place is here, and then, oh yeah, you can see it there. Can you get a close-up? No, it's the same close-up. I want to know the percentage, because that looks like it's like, I don't know, 95, 95%. So it looks like there's no other way to see it. This has got a little bit of a bar here, but I don't think that's going to, that's not going to get me where I need to go. All right, so we're just going to go for it with 5% of two gigs, so that's 500 meg, something like that. 
All right, so this sound here, I kind of like it, and it's on one bar, so let's record it. All right, so it's pretty clean. Oh, and I had it on uh, one shot, and I don't really like it on one shot, but we'll keep it on one shot for now. So then we'll double it, double the length. And that should be two bars. So that's my first, uh, it sounds like an effect actually. We'll call it effect one, do it. Hopefully I don't run out of space. If I do, we'll just save whatever we got and I'll come back and add the other stuff. Cause you can purge. If you go to here, you can purge and you can purge any sample that's not used. So I'll, I'll build it as far as I can, and if we run out of space, we'll just kill whatever's left and reload it, or reload whatever sounds good. All right, so we got the first sound, and then I still wanted to find a good drum beat, but I heard something that sounded atmospheric, I think, uh, was it here? Number two, number two. <laughs> That sounds pretty cool. So maybe we'll we'll do the first sound. We'll mute it. Do this as the second sound. And that'll be my second effect. Which uh, it's a weird place to start, but it's kind of how it's showing up. So, and then atmosphere-wise. That sounds pretty spacey. That sounds spacey too. That totally sounds spacey. Maybe we'll do something spacey. All right, so we'll do something spacey. So it sounds like it's uh, four bars. So let's double the length and see how far it goes. Oh, I have to re-record it because uh, it's gonna cut it off. So I'm gonna put it on that one, put it on note on, and then I'll hold it to get it to play. And let's see if it loops it clean and then we'll figure out some kind of beat. All right, so it's not perfect, uh, but I think we'll keep it for now. And this will be like a backtrack. And so now I need to come up with my beat and I didn't really find a beat that I liked when I was listening. Uh, all right, let's... I like that sound. I don't know how you can have all these effects without having a beat. I better find a beat or else we'll get too far and the beat won't go and we won't be where we need to be. That might help. So we'll lay this down and then find a drum that maybe goes with this. We're gonna have to do note on if we're gonna get all crazy with it. Just so we can time it. So let's go for it. Alright, 
so I, I kind of like that stab. Now hopefully I can find a beat to lay over the top. Oh, maybe I can uh, just use part of a beat. Like maybe take part of this. Oh, better get on a different track before I start messing up my sound. Let's make sure I didn't ruin it. Let's save. My memory's full, so my... <laughs> Alright, so that's good, and that's just the back track and the staff. Let's try it with an effect. Oh, it's gonna play that twice? I don't think it sounds good twice. Alright, what about this one? What does that sound? Did I already use it? I might have already used it. Here's the first version. Here's the second one. Yep, I already used it. Well, that just goes to show you it must be a good sound. So this will be stab effect two, because it's the same as the other one, or it should be B. Actually, let's do B. Because then I'll think, uh, let's call it one B. That way I'll know it's the same sound as the other one. Hey, what did I just rename? I thought I renamed you. Stab. One. B. Say. Do it. And then this one will become. Stab. Effect. One. A. That way I'll know they're, they kind of go together so I won't play them at the same time. All right, so this was, let's do that and that. Uh, do these go? So this one goes with everything. All right, so here's the first version. And here's the second version. Sounds pretty similar, but it's not the same. All right, so now back to figuring out the drum. So for the drums, That's cool. That's cool, but we need drums. We need drums, you guys. And we need drum and bass drums. Those are more break beat. I like the way that sounds. Alright, oh, so it's either these drums or those drums. That sounds kind of light to me. Uh, do I have any drums on four? I have those drums. I'll tell you. But they don't. Who deserve? Well, you get. Indy. You're. Uh... Nothing on that one? Ooh, I got room for some more drums. Ooh. I'm going to look for some more drums. Because I wasn't really happy with those drums. And I got. I got two pads left. I think I'm out of sp almost out of space, but I got two pads left. So I have. A ton of sounds. So sounds sounds are not my problem. Uh drum and bass. Drum and bass industrial strength. Don't like those. Uh, what's in here? Oh, that's rocking right there. So we got one. All 
right, let's see if we can find one more, one more bass, uh, drum and bass loop. Hopefully I don't run out of space. Uh, what's in here? I don't like any of those. Um, Bruto, what's in Bruto? Yeah, that sounds brutal. Um, let's check my dubstep. Uh, and I need like 175, so you guys are way slow. Uh, drum mix. Yeah, you guys are going to be too slow. Uh, da -da 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 -da. What's in here? Bass, brutal, hop loops, breaks. Maybe this one. I think I'll load that one. Did I load it? No. Alright. I don't even know if this is going to go. Let's see if I save it. Am I out of space? Am I pushing it? Am I pushing the memory too far? Are you going to croak on me? Ooh, it's inching up. Alright. Um, let's see where we're at. Alright, we're doing good on time. We're only 20 minutes in and... I've only just picked some of the beats. So I like this one. And it's four bars. But what's the BPM on that? It's 170. Okay, so here's a case where it's close. And I can either warp it or time stretch it. But I think time stretching is cleaner. So I'm going to take the sound. Go to sample edit. Go to process. Go to time stretch. It got the time wrong because it's actually 170. So I'm going to put it on 170, which is what it should be on. 170. And then put it to 175. Do it. And that should stretch it just enough that if I loop it, it loops perfect. Um, I think I'm going to loop it without the other sounds until we get it fixed. All right, so, oh, and I got to put it on note on so we can control it. So, all right, let's record it. Let's see if it loops. a nice loop loop drum now it doesn't sound as hard as the other beat but at least if I save and I got this I got a foundation I got a few tracks and I can maybe just figure out what to do with the vocals I think I better record the vocals now because I don't want to run out of space and not have my vocals and I heard I had loaded some good sounds Check out the, the vocals. I'll tell you what I know. I know that, in fact, too many kids that begin with pot end up with heroin, then on to LSD. I know that if you drink, you suffer a loss of judgment, if you drink to excess. But I also know that judgment returns when you sober up. I know, and so do you. When you flip out on an acid trip, you never know when you're going to slip out again. This is now, Bentley, not a couple of years ago. We've had time now to see and study the effects of LSD. People who haven't had a dose in weeks sail out on another trip. They never know when. The minute they drop one acid capsule or ingest it in any way, they bought the farm. They've lost any chance to depend on and even restore that most precious of all inner senses, judgment. And in my way of thinking, without judgment, you might as well be dead. Your brain is, so why not the rest of you? We were talking about marijuana. We still are. Marijuana is the flame. Heroin is the fuse. LSD is the bomb. So don't you try to equate liquor with marijuana, mister. Not with me. You may sell that jazz to another pothead, but not to somebody who spends most of their time holding some sick kid's head while he vomits wow, and wretches a long at, at 4 o'clock in the morning. And when his knees get enough starch back in him so he can stand up and empty his pockets, you can bet he'll turn oh out a stick gosh. or two on marijuana. And you can double your money. He'll be holding a sugar cube or a cap or two. So don't you con me with your mind expansion, slob. I deal with kids every day. I try to clean up the mess that people like you oh make out gosh. of them. I'm the expert here. You're not. That was a long loop. But 
there were some gems in there. There are some serious gems in there, and I think I'm gonna, I'm gonna chop it. I think I'm gonna chop it. So first, let's process it, and we're gonna increase the gain because it looks like it's a little low. So let's uh, do gain change, bring it up uh, six. Do it. All right, and then that part where it says it's the bomb, I thought that was really cool. So I guess I need to either slice this or cut it because I need to start saving memory. So I think we can slice on the fly. So trim, slice. Can I pick a pad? Um, let's see. Let's see if we can slice this on the fly. I think I can. How do I do it? Play. I'll tell you what I know. I know that, in fact, too many kids that begin with pot end up with heroin, then on to LSD. I know that if you drink, you suffer a loss of judgment. If you drink to excess. But I also know that judgment returns when you sober up. But I also know that judgment returns when you sober up. I know, and so do you. When you flip out on an acid trip, you never know when you're going to slip out again. This is now, Bentley, not a couple of years ago. We've had time now to see and study the effects of LSD. People who haven't had a dose in weeks sail out on another trip. They never know when. The minute they drop one acid capsule or ingest it in any way, they bought the farm. They've lost any chance to depend on and even restore that most precious of all inner senses, judgment. And in my way of thinking, without judgment, you might as well be dead. Your brain is, so why not the rest of you? We were talking about marijuana. We still are. Marijuana is the flame. Heroin is the fuse. LSD is the bomb. So don't you try to equate liquor with marijuana, mister. Not with me. You may sell that jazz to another pothead, but not to somebody who spends most of their time holding some sick kid's head while he vomits and wretches sitting on a curbstone at 4 o'clock in the morning. And when his knees get enough starch back in him so he can stand up and empty his pockets, you can bet he'll turn out a stick or two on marijuana. And you can double your money he'll be holding a sugar cube or a cap or two. So don't you con me with your mind expansion slop. I deal with kids every day. I try to clean up the mess that people like you make out of them. I'm the expert here. You're not. Okay, so let's see if we can save it with those slices in there. I don't know if I'm going to be able to export this or if I can just have it have those slices in it. Okay, so I got these slices, but if I don't make a program, I don't think it'll work. So I think I have to convert it to a program. All right, so convert to new drum program using slices. Um... I think I'm just going to go for it. If we run out of space, I'll just be screwed. Do it. All right, so let's see if it made the new. I'll tell you what I know. I'll tell you what I know. The kids that begin with pot end up with heroin. Then I'll... So I actually wanted to try something else, and I think maybe now's a really good time to try it. I wanted to do, like, a different arrangement. So instead of putting them, like, piece by piece like I normally do, I want to take another sequence, like this sequence here. Oh, I have to copy all my stuff. I think I'll copy all my stuff first. Hopefully, I don't run out of space. So, shift. Um, do I copy the sequence? Yeah, I copy the sequence. Copy this whole sequence with all its tracks to this new version, which I'm going to call Mix. And I'm going to do a Mute Mix, because I haven't shown a Mute Mix in a long time. So, now, I made a new track called Mute or mute mix, and it should have the same thing as track one. So track one is here, track two is here, let's save. And then what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna stretch it out to like 30 bars, or maybe even 60 bars. But first let's see if I kept everything without destroying what I had. Okay, so I did. So then I have this at four bars. I'm gonna go eight, 16, 32. So now it's 32 bars, and then during the 32 bars, I'm going to sequence it out so I can have like 32 bars worth of song. And the way you do that is some of that stuff is already laid out because I had uh, copied it. So you basically pick the track you want, which I think is these vocals. I'll tell you what I know. Which is where I'm at. Uh, and I'm going to go ahead and turn off the drum loop, turn off the back track, and now I'm going to lay down over those 32 bars how this thing should sound. So uh, what I typically do is I pick a new track. And since this is my vocal track and nothing's on it, I'm going to start with that. We'll see if we can do it. And we'll do a different type of arranger. Okay, so now um, I'm going to go to a new track. 
here, and this is where I'm going to do all my arranging. I'm going to pick a whole different pad that's not used just to not uh, mess up what I got. So let's make a new one. So we'll go new program, and I'm going to use this new program, and I'm going to call it um, mix. Because I'm going to do my mute mixes with this on when I have it record so I don't mess up any of my other sequences. So this track should be on. All right, let's label it mix. And it's just kind of like a dummy track just to hold the hold the recorded events. And then I'm going to go to mute group. And now when I record, I don't need vocal. I'm going to lay down my song. So let's uh, let's see if I can get the beat going. So if I did it right, I just laid down a 32 bar sequence. Okay, so now that I got that 32 bar sequence down, I'm going to go back and I'm going to try to do the vocals over the top of it. And for these vocals, I didn't really keep track of what he's saying. So we're going to have to just wing it. I'll tell you what I know. I know that in fact too many... Actually, do I want to do the... Um... There's one other thing I, I probably should show here, and I kind of don't want to do it, but I need to figure it out, so I'm going to do it anyway. So I'm going to come here to my pad color, and I'm going to try to I'm going to try to color code these things. So we want to do uh, classic velocity. No, I want to think it's pick a pad, pick a color, pick a pad. How do you do it? You do classic velocity. No, fixed. Okay, so this I'll one, tell you what I know. I know that in fact too many So that sounds pretty good. So that can stay green and then the kids one. begin with pot end up with heroin, then on to LSD. Nope. I know that if you drink oh. you suffer a loss of judgment if I gotta do single pat, single pat. Alright, so then green. I'll tell you what I know. I know that in fact too many Okay, and then this the one. kids that begin with kids that begin with pot end up with heroin, then on to LSD. This one's not that I know good. the kids that begin with pot end up with heroin, then on to LSD. This one. I know that if you drink it, but I also know that judgment returns when you sober up. That sounds pretty good, so I'll make that one. But I also one. know that judgment. This one. I know, and so do you. When you flip out on an acid trip, you never know when you're going to slip out. That's pretty good, so I'll make that one red. I know, and so do you. This one. People who haven't had a dose in weeks sail out on another trip. That's can be white because I don't. People who that. haven't had a this they've one. lost any chance to depend on and even restore that most precious of all inner senses. Uh, that one doesn't sound that good. This Judgment, one? you might as well be dead. Your brain is, so why not? That one sounds really good, so I'll make that a green. Judgment, you might as well be the this rest one? of you. We were talking. That one's not that good, so let's make that a white. The rest of you. We were this about one? marijuana. We. That one's not that good, so I'll leave it white. Still are marijuana. Nope, that one's not that good. One is the flame, Harold. One is the flame, Harold. That's not that good. Heroin is the fuse. Heroin is the fuse. That's not that good. LSD is the bomb. That one I like a lot, so I'll make it green. LSD is the bomb. This one. So don't you try to equate liquor with marijuana, mister. I'll leave that one. Oh, I'll make that one red. So don't you try to equate liquor. Not with me. You may sell that jazz to another pothead, but not. That one will make it yellow. You're not with me. You and then this one. Not to one. somebody who spends most of their time holding some sick kid's head while he... Okay. So I think I got these color-coded the way I want. The greens are my primaries. 
I'll tell you what I know. I know. Oh, I shouldn't have changed it. Let's put it back. I'll tell you what I know. Okay, so I got my colors fixed. So let's get out of that. Uh, I said get out of it. Let's save it. And then what you can do to make sure these don't step on each other is go to program edit, hit this, put all. So all of these are going to get the same adjustment. Put them on note on. And should I pitch it up? Let's pitch it up. Let's see what happens. I'll tell you what I know. The kids that begin with pot end up. But I also know that judgment returns when you. I know and so do you. Let's, let's also do some weirdness with it. I'll tell you what I know. Um, mess with the pitch on the sign, sinusoidal. I'll tell you what I know. I know that in fact too many. That's maybe too much. I'll tell you what I know. I know that in fact too many. All right, so, uh, I'll tell you what I know. All right, so we'll do that. We we'll add some modulation to it. All right, so we're going to lay down the vocals now. Hopefully, hopefully I don't mess it up, but it doesn't matter because, uh, this is how we're going to do it. So now we're going to start from the beginning and I'm going to add vocals into my mix. I also know that judgment returns when you sober up. I think it recorded it good. Let's save it. Then I'll check my memory and then I'll turn the volume up. Oh, I can do an effect on it. Okay, low memory. Yeah, I know. I mentioned up. This thing's going to get close. Okay, so that sounded a little low. So one way you can fix it is you can go to here and do not the pads. You can do the whole track. And then, actually, that's the output, that's the program. Is the program the whole track? Uh, I guess we'll find out. So let's put a, an effect on this. And I think we can use EQ and filter and do a boost. There's a boost around here somewhere. Uh, air enhancer, is that my boost? Bass boost, boost highs. All right, so let's try it. LSD's the bomb. LSD's the bomb. But I also know that judgment returns when you sober up. So that's not gonna, that's not gonna boost it enough, or at least that's not the right place where I wanna boost it. Dynamics, uh, compressor, maximizer maybe. Actually, let's just play it. I'll tell you what I know. But I also know that. I'll tell you what I know. I'll tell you what I know. I know that in fact too many. Uh, that doesn't look like it's boosting. Master light, slam it, boost really low signal. <laughs> I'll tell you what I know. I'll tell you what I know. I'll tell you what I know. I. I'll tell you what. I'll tell you what I know. It doesn't sound like it's boosting it that much. I'll tell you what I. I'll tell you what I know. Threshold. I'll tell you what I know. I'll tell you what I know. Release? I'll, I'll tell you what I know. I'll tell you what I know. Nah, buddy. You're not, uh, you're not boosting enough. You gotta go. Alright, so let's find a different way to boost it. Alright, let's boost it with, uh, let's boost it with harmonics. Nope. It's not vintage effects. It's not channel strip. Is it modulation? Can't do it with modulation, I don't think. Hmm. Uh, 
Well, uh, I guess I'm going to have to figure out a different way to boost it. I thought I saw something that was a straight boost. Oh, maybe it's an EQ. EQ. EQ kill. I mean, maybe I can boost it instead of killing it. Frequency. Gain. There it is there. All right, so let's try it. I'll tell you what I know. Take the low out. I'll tell you what I know. I'll tell you what. I'll tell you what. Okay, so it's not affecting everybody. So that's my first problem. So uh, I need to put these effects across all the whole program. Um, where did it put it? All right, so we're not uh, we're not home yet. We gotta. I think this is the right place here. All right, so let's let's go ahead and add that same effect here. It was a kill EQ. I think it was kill EQ. I'll tell you what I know. I'll tell you what I. I'll tell you what I know. Yeah, it's here. I'll tell you. We can't begin with. We can't begin. Yeah. We can't. So now it's gonna do them all. I'll tell you what I know. We can't begin with pot end up. And let's increase their mid. I'll tell you what I know. I know that in fact too many. I'll tell you what I know. All right, so then. Let's listen to it real quick. I also know that judgment returns when you sober up. Uh, what happened to my LSD's the bomb? That was the main one. Or oh, maybe that's the one that has the effects on it from before. Let's go in and, and check that effects. This one, delete, delete. LSD's the bomb. Okay, so now. LSD is the bomb. LSD is the bomb. But I also know that judgment returns when you sober up. LSD is the bomb. LSD is the bomb. I'll tell you what I know. LSD is the bomb. LSD is the bomb. So I like these, but my other ones are getting in the way. So I can either turn these up or turn those down. Um. And I really wanted to try something else, so I'm going to try it here. On this mix, I have this effect and this effect and that effect, which all come in too loud. So I'm going to go through, and on this first one, effect one, uh, where is it? I got to find it first. LSD is the bomb. LSD is the bomb. But I also know that judgment returns when you sober up. So that one I think is this one. LSD is the bomb. LSD is the bomb. But I also know that judgment returns when you sober up. It's right here. So then you can take this sound, go to piano roll, go to velocity, and use your magnifying glass to get the whole the whole song. And then use the pencil and bring it all down. Why don't you? You could always undo if you mess it up. So let's just see if this works. LSD is the bomb. LSD is the bomb. But I also know that judgment returns when you sober up. LSD is the bomb. I'll tell you what I know. LSD is a bomb. LSD is a bomb. Okay, so that worked. All right, so let's save. Save. You gonna save, dude? There we go. Go back to main, and now I gotta fix the other effects. This one, effect two. So let's find it. LSD is a bomb. LSD is the bomb. But I also know that judgment returns when you sober up. All right, so I guess we can do this one first, maybe. LSD is the bomb. LSD is the bomb. But I also know that judgment returns when you sober up. LSD is the bomb. LSD is the bomb. I'll tell you what I know. LSD is the bomb. LSD is the bomb. 
Shout out to Dread with Quake like I would have Alright, so that one, this one, I know which one it is, it's this one. So this one, we're going to edit it differently. We're going to go to Track Mix and turn it down from here. LSD is the bomb. LSD is the bomb. But I also know that judgment returns when you sober up. LSD is the bomb. LSD is the bomb. I'll tell you what I know. LSD is the bomb. LSD is the bomb. So don't you try to wait like I would know. You're not with me. You I didn't even see it, so that's ghetto. Do I have to go to Pad Mix? Maybe I have to go to Pad Mix. LSD is the bomb. LSD is the bomb. But I also know that judgment returns when you sober up. LSD is the bomb. LSD is the bomb. I'll tell you what I know. LSD is the bomb. LSD is the bomb. So don't you try to equate like I would know. You're not with me. You may sell that jazz to another pothead. But... You're not with me. You may sell that jazz to another pothead. But... All right, so I think that takes care of that. And now I got to fix this other effect, this one here. Uh, I think it's this other one. Let's find it first. LSD is the bomb. LSD is the bomb. But I also know that judgment returns when you sober up. Tell you what I know. LSD is a bomb. LSD is a bomb. So don't you try to wait like I would know one. You're not with me. You may sell that jazz to another pocket. But... You're not with me. You may sell that jazz to another pocket. But... Yeah, you might as well be dead. Your brain is so what Okay, so it's here. Go to piano roll. It's already on velocity. It's already on pencil. And then... I'm surprised I can't just bring it down faster. Oh, do I have the... I'm not, I don't even think I have the whole thing. Oh, I do have the whole thing. Oh, I think I moved it. Did I move it? Undo. Uh, I think I moved it. I thought this moved up a pad. Let me... Let me check real quick. Uh, yeah, let's check it. Oh, oh, LSD is the bomb. Oh, 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 LSD is the bomb. But I also know that judgment returns when you sober up. LSD is a bomb. LSD is a bomb. I'll tell you what I know. LSD is a bomb. LSD is a bomb. So don't you try to wait like I would know one. You're not with me. You may sell that jazz to another pothead. But... You're not with me. You may sell that jazz to another pothead. But... Jack, you might as well be dead. Your brain is... No, it came in okay. All right, so we're doing a lot of cool different effects. So it'll make a good video, but I don't run out of space or I don't crash my NPC from loading it too much. Okay, so we got all these things laid out on this mix track. And I think I got enough vocals. I want to do something different for the second half. So I think either let's go ahead and we'll just take the sequence and we'll duplicate it and call it mix two. And this will be the second half of this song. But since I don't want to start from the beginning, I'm going to copy everything I have right now on the second half. And then on the second half, I'm going to go through and edit it and take out a bunch of stuff so I can add different stuff back to it. Hopefully, I won't mess it up. Okay, so now I'm going to put it on overdub so I don't er erase what I had. And we're going to start from the beginning. And I'm going to redo what I did, and hopefully I can do it cleanly. So let's see if we can do it. LSD is the bomb.
gonna put them all back. Oops. So I just gotta fix the drone. Alright, so I think that's good enough. So I kind of mixed it up a little bit. I think I messed up a couple times. You can go in and look at piano roll if you want to clean it up, but I'm not going to go that far. I'm already at 50 minutes and I'm, I'm showing a lot of what I want to show anyway. Okay, so this is the second half. And uh, for the second half, I'm going to add some new tracks. So um, let's pick some different vocals. So I'm going to come to track number eight. And I'm going to make a new set of vocals called V2. New set of vocals. And then I'm going to put it on my vocal sounds. And I'm going to record different sounds to go with this sequence. So put it on overdub so I don't mess up anything. Uh, actually, this is an individual track, so it wouldn't mess it up anyway. But I, I'm still going to be careful and put it on overdub. I'm going to start over and I'll make different vocals. Big chance to begin with pot, end up with heroin, then on to LSD. I know that if you drink, you suffer a loss of judgment. If you drink to excess, people who haven't had a dose in weeks sail out on another trip. They never know when LSD is the bomb. They've lost any chance to depend on and even restore that most precious of all inner senses, judgment. Rest it. We would. Okay. I know, and so do you. When you flip out on an acid trip, you never know when you're going to slip out again. This is now, Bentley, not a couple of years ago. We've had time now to see and study the effects of LSD. One is the fuse. One is the flame. Hero. Dillard. Meryl. About marijuana. We sh. Not to somebody who spends most of their time holding some street shit. Like, I'm a. LSD's a bomb. LSD's a bomb. LSD's a bomb. LSD's a bomb. Okay, so that's a good second vocal. There's a few duplicates. I'll save it. And now I just want to add a few different effects somewhere in the mix. And then, uh, then I'm going to purge everything else. And this is going to be my beat. A little, little whack, but I'm going to roll with it. Let's see if I got some cool sounds to throw in here. I think I'll use my... Let's go back to those drum and bass sounds just to kind of keep it all in the same area. I bet I can... I bet I could throw this in there. Program. Note on. I'm going to see if I can drop this in there as a, a drum accent. I don't know if I can, but I'm going to go for it. It'll be the drum uh, ghost beat. And I'm going to play it in the back of the second half. All right, so let's see if I can drop it in there. Uh, here we go. Chance to begin with pot, end up with heroin, then on to LSD. I know that if you drink, you suffer a loss of judgment. If you drink, you excess. People who haven't had a dose in weeks sail out on another trip. They never know when LSD is a bomb. They've lost any chance to depend on it and restore that most precious of all inner senses. Judgment. Rest it. We were talking. I know, and so do you. When you flip out on an acid trip, you never know when you're going to slip out again. This is now, Bentley, not a couple of years ago. We had time now to see and study the effects of LSD. Alright, that was pretty slick. I'm going to save it. And then I'm going to add one more track. And then this will be, this will be the song. I like that. I like that sound, so I'm gonna I'm gonna totally mess up my whole beat and throw this in there somewhere. So program edit note. It's already on note on. Did I not take them off all? Well, forget it. I'm just gonna go for it. Let's figure out how to throw it in here. So this will be my stab two. And this will be a second stab. I don't know how it's gonna go with that drum, but let's go for it. Get to begin with pot, end up with heroin, then on to LSD. I know that if you drink, you suffer a loss of connection, you drink excess. People haven't had a dose and we sail out on another trip. They never know when LSD is a bomb. They've lost any chance to depend on it, even restore.
sure that what I call in our senses. I think that's enough sounds, enough effects. I'm going to save, and hopefully I can not break this thing by purging all the stuff I'm not using. So let's go for it. Here, purge, unused samples. Did it purge it? Uh, I guess we can check memory and find out. It don't look like it purged it. Purge, unused samples. Okay, did that do it? Hmm. Uh oh. Do I still have a song? So it doesn't look like it purged the unused samples. So I'm not going to screw around with this. I'm going to come here. I'm going to go to my song. I'm going to hit record. I'm going to hit mix one, mix two, mix one, mix two. And that's going to be my song. Check it out, check it out, check it out, check it out. This is gonna be the beat, 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 you may sell that jazz to another pothead. You're not me. You may sell that jazz to another pothead. Jack, you might as well be dead. Your brain is so what up. Not to somebody who spends most of their time only some sick kids head life. Not to somebody who spends most of their time only some sick kids head life. Oh, I see the bomb. Oh, I see the bomb. Kids at the beginning with pot end up with heroin. Then on the LSD. I know that if you drink yourself, you'll lose a jet. Take a break, excess. People who haven't had a dose in weeks sail out on another trip. They never know when. Unless they eat the bomb. They've lost any chance to depend on and even restore that most precious all in our senses. Gotcha. That's it. We were talking. I know, and so do you. When you flip out on an acid trip, you never know when you're gonna slip out again. This is now, Bentley, not a couple of years ago. We had time now to see and study the effects of LSD. One is a blue zip. One is a flame. Her. Still are. Meryl. About now, what? We. Somebody who spends most of their time only some sick kids head life. I'm a let's see the bomb. 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 But I also know that judgment returns when you sober up. Let's see the bomb. Let's see the bomb. I'll tell you what I know. Let's see the bomb. Let's see the bomb. Set on future and we'll quit until now. You may sell that jazz to another pothead. You're not me. You may sell that jazz to another pothead. Jack, you might as well be dead. Your brain is so what up. Not to somebody who spends most of their time only some sick kids head life. Not to somebody who spends most of their time only some sick kids head life. Well, I see the bomb. Well, I see the bomb. Yes, if you go and party, I'm carrying that on the LSD. I know that if you drink yourself, you'll lose a bit. People have another dose and we sell out another dose. That's how it goes. That's how it goes. That's how it goes. See you next time. See you next time. See you next time. Trump C. Trump C. Trump C. Peace. Peace. Peace.